I am Dr. Meghna Sarveya, practicing obstetrician and gynecologist in Malad since the last 15 years. I have been the founder, consultant and full-time obstetrician gynecologist practicing in Cloud9 Hospital since it started. So the female reproductive system comprises of the external reproductive organs and the internal reproductive organs. Now the external reproductive organs, we have the vulva, which is the external part which you see, which is comprises of the labia majora and the minora. Then we have the sensitive organ, which is called as the clitoris. And we have the vaginal opening from where you get your menstrual blood flowing out. The internal reproductive organs comprises of the uterus which is also called as the womb from which the menstrual blood flows out and also this is the organ which rears the children in future. The mouth of the uterus is also called as the cervix that is the connection between the uterus and the vagina and this is the cervix which is very important because we see a lot of cases of cervical cancer also in these days today. Then the other organs are the both sides tubes which is the connection between the ovaries and the uterus where the pregnancy actually forms and both ovaries which are the egg producing organs. From the ovary the eggs get released and they are picked up into the tube and that's how a pregnancy is formed. 